My question is to Minister Wong in her capacity representing the Prime Minister. Minister, I'm asking this question on behalf of millions of Australians, but also Julian Assange's father, John Shipton, who went to San Diego in mid-March hoping to hear that his son would be released. Did the Prime Minister raise the ongoing prosecution and detention of Julian Assange with President Biden during their meeting on 14 March this year? Thank you, Senator Shoebridge. Minister. Uh, thank you, uh, uh, and thank you to Senator Sir Shoebridge for his uh, question. Uh, I'd make a few points about Mr Assange. Uh, uh, there is, I understand that there is strong interest in the case. There is a depth of community set sentiment, and we have made clear publicly uh, before the election and since that the government's view is that Mr Assange's case has dragged on too long and should be brought to a close. Um, it is not generally my practice to give chapter and verse of everything that is said in every diplomatic communications, but in the interest of transparency on this issue, I have said uh, that I have personally expressed this view, uh, the view that is that Mr Assange's case has dragged on long enough and should be brought to a close to the governments of the United States and the government of the United Kingdom, and I will continue to do so. So, so the, the Prime Minister has also made clear in the Parliament, and I'd refer you to his answers, uh, that he has raised this case uh, at the appropriate levels. What I would say is this, and you would know this, Senator Shoebridge, as a lawyer. Uh, we are not able, as an Australian government, to intervene in another country's legal or court processes. That, that, well, it is true. It is true. And, you, know, the, the, you would understand. Order. Well, Senator, Senator Shoebridge. There is a thing called the rule of law. There is, there is a principle called the separation of powers. Well, Order. And no amount of bellowing at me from, the, from that end of the chamber is going to change the fact that a court has to determine the legal process. So we can raise these issues as I have and as the Prime Minister have, uh, but we are not able uh, to alter the judicial processes of another country. Order. <laughs> Minister Wong, please, please resume your seat, Senator Wong. Senator Wish Wilson, those comments are disrespectful and disorderly, and I would ask you not to call out. Senator Shoebridge? Thank you, President. Oh, mm? uh, sorry, I thought you were on a point of order. Uh, thank you. Senator Wish Wilson, uh, how would you propose that we do that? Send the Australian Army into a court? I mean, really? Uh, Minister, please resume your seat. Senator Wish Wilson. Uh, I, seeing as I was asked a direct uh, question, Senator Wish Wilson, please I'll, resume I, I, your seat. I can respond. Senator Wish Wilson, please resume your seat. Senator Shoebridge, first supplementary. Um, thank you, President. Uh, Minister, the Prime Minister has said, and I think you have too, enough is enough. And the Prime Minister said he wants a resolution of this matter, but this, to use his words, requires quiet diplomacy. How could a conversation between President Biden, PM Albanese and PM Sunak, which he was in just two weeks ago, not be the most important kind of quiet diplomacy to use to free Julian Assange? And why wasn't it used? Uh, thank you, Senator Shoebridge. Minister Wong. Uh, uh, that isn't what I said, and you've made a set of assertions there uh, which may or may not be true. And I would again say, uh, that we have at the Prime Minister's level and uh, at Foreign Minister level uh, been very clear uh, in our views that this matter has dragged on too long and it should be brought to a close. Uh, but I again make the point that there is a legal process uh, which is um, you know, in accordance with uh, the tradition of the separation of powers, which I regard as uh, an important part of democracy. Uh, uh, it is not something that the Australian government can Order. resolve. Having said that, it is, it is appropriate. Um, it's it's Minister not, Wong, Senator Wish Wilson, I called you to order twice. I expect you to come to order. Minister, did you wish to continue? Uh, uh, what we are doing what we can between government and government. Uh, but there are limits to what that diplomacy can achieve. Thank you, Minister. The time until for answering I'm... has expired. Oh. Senator Shoebridge, second supplementary. Thank you, President. It is a simple question, Minister, that Julian Assange's family are asking, and as Australian citizens, they deserve an answer to. Did their Prime Minister 
ask President Biden to drop the United States prosecution and allow Julian to come home when they met just a few short weeks ago? Please answer Thank the question. Thank you, Senator Shoebridge. Uh, the, the Prime Minister has made his views clear about this matter having been brought to, to, uh, dragged on too long. But I, I again would make this point. I would make this point uh, that whilst we are doing what we can between government and government, there are limits until Mr Assange has concluded the legal processes. Uh, and uh, I think on no, it is that there are legal processes which are still on foot. Well, Order, which cannot... Senator Rice. And, and I'd, Order. I'd also... um, Minister, please resume your seat. Senator Shoebridge. Um, thank you, President. My point of order is relevance. My question was about a meeting between the President and the Prime Minister, not about court proceedings, but about a meeting between the President and the Prime Minister, and the, minister, uh, and the minister is refusing to address it. Thank you, Senator Shoebridge. I believe the minister is being relevant to your question, Minister. I did respond to it. And I'm actually trying to be helpful. And if you perhaps listened to what I'm saying, Senator Shoebridge, what I'm saying to you is that whilst, however, there are legal proceedings on foot, it is very difficult for there to be resolution between governments. I think that is an observation of fact. Uh, well, uh, uh, minister, yeah, there are some, there minister, are some countries. Minister, some, some, please some, resume your seat. Senator Shoebridge, this is not a debate. Senator Shoebridge.